Hello viewers and welcome to the last of my current three runs on the new Drive Club horsepower pack and of course uh, there was this run in the McLaren P1 GTR as well, fantastic car uh, and really just racing around the Nakasendo circuit again, circuit I've enjoyed a great deal just looking at trying to improve my time uh, of course this is the time you saw in the split with the Ferrari XXK in the first video uh, but I like the sort of over the shoulder cam I've got here, works really well with the forward bonnet cam they've included, forward bonnet cam should I say, the forward cockpit cam they've included in the game. Uh, and it's a circuit that, you know, I think it just shows how there's always so many ways to maximise time, you know, on these circuits. It really is about getting your line right and I think we come up to a direction change here in just a moment where you just want to turn in early, really get that early part of the kerb and then that takes you almost straight through that section hard on the brakes here and the car understeers really slowly it's quite a tight hairpin that corner and sometimes it's difficult to know whether it's better to drive it as i drive it or better to drift it but certainly my driving style leans towards using maximum amount of tarmac and trying to keep up with these other top times that have been set here as well and gradually improving my time Top of the hill here, this is where we're coming to a corner in a moment, not just yet, a couple more corners where I, I tend to struggle a bit. But round here, it's just a case of getting in nice and slowly and then progressively accelerating. I find I get a snap of power and that spins up the rear wheels on some of these exits. And again, round here, just getting on the power, that's it. I tend to use a higher outer line for that final corner. This is the corner I struggle on, There's still lots of improvement to be found in this next section. As we go into the trees, we've got a left-hander where I struggle, but I'm watching the other ghost cars and I can see they're using a much wider line than me uh, through all through this section. So I didn't know you could drive on this out a bit, so that was sort of off the track. So sometimes, you know, it's all about exploring the track limits and if you don't always know them as I didn't there, tunnels look spectacular. I love the lighting on the dashboard fantastic really nice feeling of speed such a fast feeling game we really do feel the speed and it goes really well with the turn up your speakers loud and you're sucked right into the drive club experience great to see it's coming along uh, lots of improvements of course the yeah, first season pass is coming to an end now but we look forward to future additions to the game i hope we get a few more circuits certainly there's some decent cars but i would like some new circuits added in here and there adding a bit more variety to the game but I'm going to leave you now with this uh, McLaren action and there'll be more from me very soon.